Serbia has once again demonstrated its growing capabilities in unmanned systems at the Partner 2025 Defense Exhibition in Belgrade, unveiling a suite of new drones that reflect both tactical innovation and domestic industrial maturity. Among the highlights, the Senka Electric VTOL drone embodies a modern approach to light attack and reconnaissance missions. Compact and electrically powered, the Senka carries two 60mm guided munitions and can operate day or night, providing tactical units with a low-signature aerial platform that is well-suited for fast deployments in varied terrain. Its vertical takeoff and landing capability eliminates the need for runways, enabling units to deploy the drone from confined locations such as farm tracks, urban courtyards, or temporary forward operating bases. With a wingspan of 5 meters, a maximum takeoff weight of 40 kilograms, and a payload capacity of 8 kilograms, the Senka is capable of more than 3 hours of endurance and a radius exceeding 50 kilometers, offering a reliable tactical reach while maintaining quiet operations thanks to its electric propulsion. The integration of electro-optical gimbals and autonomous guidance allows pre-planned mission execution and precision strike capabilities, while keeping human oversight in the loop for weapons release. The combination of these features ensures that the Senka provides a practical and versatile tool for reconnaissance, surveillance, and precision engagement against lightly defended targets, bridging the gap between conventional drones and manned tactical aircraft. Alongside Senka, Serbia introduced an armed variant of the Vrabak Mini UAV, marking a significant upgrade from its traditional reconnaissance role. The Vrabak is a small, fixed-wing electric drone with a 3-meter wingspan and an 11-kilogram maximum launch weight, designed for portability and ease of deployment. In its new configuration, it carries a 4-projectile 40mm munitions rack, allowing small units to deliver precise strikes while retaining the UAV's original intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR, capabilities. With one hour of endurance and a 25-kilometer operational radius, the armed Vrabak provides company-level formations with a rapid-response aerial asset. Its catapult launch and parachute or airbag recovery system facilitate operations from constrained locations, further enhancing its tactical utility. The small, quiet electric propulsion system ensures reduced acoustic and thermal signatures, making it difficult to detect until munitions are already en route. The UAV's autonomous navigation and camera-guided bombing mode simplify operations for minimal crews, enabling a platoon or border patrol to conduct reconnaissance, identify fleeting targets, and deliver precise kinetic effects without exposing personnel to unnecessary risk. By expanding the Vrabak's role from ISR to limited precision strike, Serbia has reinforced the value of small, cost-effective UAVs in modern tactical environments. For longer endurance missions and more significant strike capability, Serbia showcased the Pegasus drone, a multipurpose unmanned aerial vehicle emphasizing both ISR and precision engagement. With an operational radius exceeding 200 km and a payload capacity of 54 kg, Pegasus offers up to 10 hours of endurance, making it a persistent presence over the battlefield. Its fully autonomous takeoff and landing, integrated rescue and return functions, and support for modular strike kits such as RASH, 2M enable the system to perform a wide spectrum of tasks, including target designation, artillery correction, post-strike assessment, and direct precision action. Delivered as a complete operational package comprising three aircraft, a ground control station, retranslation capabilities, and logistical support, Pegasus exemplifies Serbia's approach to deployable, modular, and autonomous aerial solutions. The system's flexibility allows commanders to integrate it into existing command structures and sensor-to-shooter networks, providing a long-endurance aerial platform capable of delivering both intelligence and kinetic effects. Its ISR capabilities extend well beyond the immediate front lines, providing situational awareness for operational planning, threat assessment, and the coordination of follow-on actions, while its precision strike capabilities enable responsive, 
low collateral engagements when necessary. Adding to this growing unmanned ecosystem, the OBAD Combat Multicopter demonstrates Serbia's focus on modularity and rapid tactical deployment. This short-range, eight-motor VTOL platform is capable of carrying guided anti-tank missiles, unguided rockets, mortar-type munitions, or a 40-kilogram cargo payload for resupply missions. With a cruise speed of approximately 45 km per hour, operational altitude up to 500 meters, and endurance of 12 to 20 minutes, ABAD bridges the gap between small expendable drones and larger tactical UAVs. Its modular payload approach allows operators to quickly switch between strike and logistics roles, providing tactical units with a versatile tool for both offensive and support operations. The integration of an optronic suite, including a day camera with 30 times optical zoom, a thermal channel, and a laser rangefinder, ensures precise target acquisition before engagement. This combination of features positions OBAD as an asset capable of executing ambushes, choke point overwatch, rapid response anti armor operations, and delivery of critical supplies, all from austere or dispersed locations without exposing crude assets to risk. The reusable nature of the platform, along with the quick change payload system, emphasizes Serbia's commitment to low cost, high efficiency unmanned solutions that complement larger, more expensive aerial systems. The evolution of the Comorac family highlights Serbia's innovative adaptation of legacy warhead stocks into modern FPV attack drones. The Comorac 3, a single-use, pilot-guided multirotor, offers short-range strike capabilities optimized for environments with electronic warfare saturation. Compact and manually controlled via FPV console, the drone carries repurposed Malietka warheads or a 150mm explosively formed penetrator, enabling precise attacks against armored vehicles, fortified positions, or bunkers. Its effective radius of up to 10 km, combined with a minimum endurance of 10 minutes and a maximum payload of 3 kg, provides tactical units with a low-cost, resilient strike solution. By integrating traditional warheads with modern drone airframes, Serbia has effectively converted stockpiled munitions into a reusable tactical tool capable of precise strikes in complex environments. The fiber-optic tether for control ensures robust signal integrity in contested electromagnetic conditions, mitigating the effects of jamming and maintaining operator command during high-stakes operations. The Comorac 3 demonstrates a pragmatic approach to low-cost, point-effect strike drones that exploit available ordnance and provide small units with immediate tactical options. Taken together, these systems reflect a comprehensive strategy by Serbia to develop a layered, modular, and cost-effective unmanned aerial capability. From the compact, quiet Senka electric VTOL for tactical reconnaissance and precision strike, to the small, catapult-launched armed Vrabak for short-range ISR and interdiction, to the long-endurance Pegasus for persistent surveillance and precision engagement and finally the modular OBAD and Comorac 3 multirotors for strike and logistics tasks. Serbia has crafted a diverse unmanned ecosystem tailored for modern operational needs. Each system emphasizes mobility, low signature, adaptability, and integration into broader command and control networks, reflecting lessons learned from recent conflicts in Ukraine, the Middle East, and other theaters where small, Reusable unmanned systems have proved decisive in both reconnaissance and strike roles. The strategic value of this unmanned portfolio extends beyond pure battlefield performance. Serbia's domestic development and production reduce reliance on foreign suppliers, enabling independent industrial growth and export potential for nations seeking affordable, flexible unmanned solutions. By focusing on modularity, ease of use, and multi-role capability, Serbian designers have ensured that these drones can operate in contested environments, support conventional forces, or augment security and border patrol tasks.
The approach also allows for rapid adaptation of munitions, sensor suites, and control systems, ensuring that operators can tailor each mission to specific tactical needs. These attributes collectively enhance both operational effectiveness and resilience, enabling small units to conduct reconnaissance, direct strikes, and logistical support without depending solely on high-value or expensive systems. The inclusion of guided munitions, from 40mm projectiles in Vrabak to 60mm glide kits in Senka and the modular payloads in OBAD, represents a shift towards precise, low-collateral effects suitable for urban and semi-urban combat environments. The ability to integrate legacy munitions, as seen with the Comorac 3, or adopt new guided kits, as in Senka, demonstrates a cost-conscious approach that maximizes available resources while maintaining tactical flexibility. Long-endurance systems like Pegasus provide persistent ISR and enable operators to engage fleeting targets with precision, extending the reach of tactical commanders and improving situational awareness at operational levels. These drones, collectively, reduce the sensor-to-shooter timeline, compress engagement windows, and allow for quick adaptation to evolving battlefield conditions. In conclusion, the Partner 2025 exhibition showcased Serbia's rapid evolution in unmanned systems, highlighting a deliberate strategy to create a balanced portfolio of drones capable of reconnaissance, precision strikes, and tactical support. By combining long-endurance ISR platforms, short-range tactical UAVs, reusable multicopters, and FPV-guided strike drones, Serbia has established a diverse, integrated ecosystem tailored for modern combat and operational flexibility. Each platform reflects careful attention to modularity, resilience to electronic warfare, low signature, and adaptability, providing the Serbian armed forces with a set of tools capable of addressing contemporary operational challenges while simultaneously supporting domestic industrial growth and potential exports. As modern conflicts continue to underscore the importance of unmanned systems for both reconnaissance and strike missions, Serbia's approach positions it as a notable contributor to the next generation of tactical UAVs, combining affordability, versatility, and practical combat effectiveness in a single, coherent suite of aerial solutions.